So we are here with Patrick from Sparta and they're from the US. Just finished the first days of Les Voiles de Saint Tropez. So Patrick, what's your feeling? Tell me. That was a great day for us. It was a slow start. The breeze was light to begin with, but you know, patience on the race committee and patience on our end and we got a really nice race off today. Yeah, it was great. Lovely. And what's your role on that boat? Uh, I trim the mainsail on the boat. Try oh. to keep us going fast. That must be hard work. It can be, yeah. Today was one of the harder days. I think the rest of the week may be a bit lighter, so we could be in better shape. Thank you. And uh, some words about this fantastic anniversary edition, 25th. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's great to see. We've obviously, there's some of the anniversary boats inside with uh, Pride and Ikra having their reunion. And uh, the event has just grown tremendously. It's fun to see the Maxis back with us. So it's a one week event again. So it's looks like it's shaping up to be a really great time. The town is thriving and the, the bars are heaving and everybody's smiling and the racing is good. So I think it's all all in line to be a great Wonderful. Great time. So tell me about the season of your of your ma wonderful boat. You're doing well, what kind of regattas and yeah. which position is this one? Which are kind of your preferred one? So we um, we just got done with more or less the classic Mediterranean circuit. So we did our, our first event of the year in Argentario. Uh, which we came away with a win on, and then we went over to Mahone in Menorca and uh, won that one as well. And then we just finished up with the Con Classic uh, the week before, which we managed to win as well. So we're here uh, after a first day. We won our first race, and we're hoping to clean sweep the year. So we wonderful! Had a, so you did win the Can Saint Tropez. We did, yeah. yeah congratulations! Yeah, thank you. So Amazing. We're, doing, uh, we're doing all right, and we're just trying to keep keep moving and doing what we know how to do and I think everybody's coming together at the right time. So here's my question. With these wonderful classic boats, what's your secret to win? You know, sailing The competition classic, is incredible. Yeah, it's, I think we're in one of the more competitive classes now, the GAFs. Um, it's really the same as, as bringing performance out of any other boat, even moderns. You know, a lot of us do a ton of modern sailing as well. I think the biggest thing is just opening yourself up to learning again because so many of the conventions that come with making a modern boat, you know, or a, a Marconi rigged, you know, traditional rigged boat move uh, don't always apply with this. So it's interesting to have to question your own convention and your own bits of knowledge and open your eyes up, you know, to be able to just look at numbers and understand what's making it work by metric and not by your rear end sometimes, you know, so it's, it's really interesting. It just takes a lot of a lot of time and effort and quantifying and repeating and, you know, a lot of this team has been together. I mean, I think this is my 10th year with the team. So All right. So many people are on the boat? We're sailing 17 this event. Wow. Uh, and Great. I, I'd say there's probably only one or two people that have been with us for less than three years. Oh, so. that's that's very important very also to have the yeah. same crew to improve and to analyze every, every detail, right? Yeah, well, our, you know, our, our owner and our, our team that puts it all together does, you know, feels the same as us. Yeah, the competition here is paramount, you know, it's, Lovely. it's second to none. So all right. that's what we're here for. So there's a lot of uh, technology within this old there is. classic boat actually hidden. There, there is and there it's isn't. A lot of, it's like yeah. inno innovation meets... Uh, sure classic uh, tradition yes, kind of exactly I all mean, right we, we have a, a traditional it's not foiling yet but it's not foiling <laughs> i think we have to change some things to make it foil no um, well she's pretty not everybody likes foil so no, you know she's fairly true to original form we still have wire rigging and we have a lot of you know not really modern textile lines and a lot of it is to protect the boat so we aren't adding places that don't stretch into a boat that's quite flexible um, but yeah we put a lot of work into our sail development we have a navigation package on the boat and electronics so we know where the wind is, know how fast we're going, you know, and we're able where to Where the competition, is, competition yeah. is going, what they're doing. Exactly. I mean, but at the end of the day, it's, um, we're all just dinghy sailors that grew up and are doing a little bit of big boat classic sailing. You know? Lovely. So, yeah. Thank you so much. Good luck. Thank you. How many more have we got as you have to say? We have four more races. Ah, four more races yeah. here. That yeah. was my question. So tomorrow you around. start in the morning or? Yes. Yeah, we'll start just after 11 tomorrow. Wonderful. Good luck. I will be there. Great. Bye. <laughs> Cheers.